Hello? Hello, sir. Good afternoon, sir. Good afternoon, sir. My name is Kele Chikiroma, sir. I'm a journalist, sir. Yes. Yeah, I, I called you sometime two weeks ago, but you told me you traveled. That I, yes. that I needed to talk to you about um, some things about um, what internal revenue service does. So I, I, yeah, I went to your office and I dropped a letter as you requested. <laughs> Hello, sir. Yes, speak journalist from where? Yeah, I, I'm a freelance journalist. I work with Ripples in Nigeria. And I also work with Program Time, sir. Okay, please, I just lost my mom this morning. Is there anything I can do to help you? Yes. I, I, I have some questions I would want you to, I want to ask you because I'm, um, there was a, there's a story I'm doing about internal revenue service in Nego State, in Nego State. So I don't know if you are, if you would really want to talk about it right now. What is the story? Okay, I went to your office to, to request for a bachelor certificate. Mm -hmm. And I was asked to bring 90,000 naira for it. Mm. Hmm? Okay. Initially, the officer I met, they charged me 150,000 naira. So we came to... 150,000? Yes. He said that is it. And I went there as an unemployed youth that I needed it to apply um, for a, a grant or for a program. And she asked me to bring 150,000 naira. I told her I did not have 150,000 naira. And after and everything... You dash her yeah, that I should give... I should give her one fifty thousand now before I can get a tax clearance certificate. As bribe. I don't just know, but I don't know if it is bribe, but she just told me that if I do it, that she's going to give me the tax clearance and that it, the one fifty thousand I'm going to pay is is a I think she said it's tax payment for four years. Okay. So my question is, is it what is it ninety thousand did, did you pay her the one fifty thousand? After everything, I paid her the ninety thousand naira. It was ninety thousand naira I paid. But have you been hearing an announcement that we don't collect cash in our cash office? I refi I refused I refused to give her cash. I asked her, of course, she be, you know there is a process. So this is this is this is a state government agency. That it is not possible for you to tell me that I cannot go to a bank or there is no account what where I can pay in the money to. So, you eventually gave her the one of the 90,000 naira? Yes, I gave her, I bought her the 90,000 naira. I even have evidence to show that okay. I gave her the money. Um, so, you want to make it a police case, it's a criminal offense. She has obtained, obtained money from you under false pretense. Yes. Because we have told everybody in the state to not collect cash. We are automated, we not collect cash. So, what she just does, she has extorted money from you. So, I hope the person is a the person is a staff. Wonderful. And you can identify the person. I can identify the person. Wonderful. In fact, I, I was given I was given I was given the task clearance certificate. You were given the task clearance certificate? Yes. And I was given um the receipt. Mm -hmm. When I checked I went to your website to confirm the 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 receipt number. It is only one that was in your website. The other one I paid for the three years. Are not there. Okay, so, so what it means is that they started money from you. Yes. And paid more, paid more money, and then the rest they put in your pockets. The, the rest I could not find it because, of course, since your, your it is very clear on your website, the payment I paid uh, is supposed to appear on your website, but it did mm. not. And if you look at if you look at the receipts with me, there are three different kinds of receipts. The one they used for 2019. The one that is for 2019 is one is a receipt, one kind of receipt. Then the one that is for 2015, 16, 17 are different kinds of, are the same receipt. There are no problem. What it means is that uh, whether staff or non staff, the person is totally running for you. And uh, so what will happen is we will, we will um, like I said, do the present to us. If you make yourself available, we'll um, um, study to inspect on it. We'll uh, appreciate your cooperation. We can apprehend those who did it. And uh, 
approach the emotion when they are getting we don't collect cash from anybody because i in fact i, I even have evidence telling her that i she should give me an account number to go and pay and she said they don't that's what i'm saying that what she did is not a normal business that's why i collected money from me under pretense so if i have all the evidence we'll make the police matter so the person can face and tell the police where she put the money to is it sure here yeah is it here or is she he said is it here or is she is she in which tax office is this in fact it, that is the one in uh there your head office in enugu a head office in enugu yes wonderful so the one in uh close to cid police in front of uh, a no police problem, so that's, our, that's our headquarters so the good thing is you know the person so at that point i was like i said i lost my mom this one so i'm not even oh, talking oh. to you because you said because you said you're a journalist because if i don't talk to you it's a bit that i throw the chairman and chairman is shielding them yes you understand so that's why I'm, i even i feel like crying in my house i'm taking the call i'm not going to take take Okay, my my condolences, my, my condolences, sir. I'm sure you're hearing the cry. Yes. But I'm taking it because if I don't talk to you, I will journalize myself. If I don't talk to you, now the story will be that uh, I'm passing from going on in the part of the island with me, and it will be covered from the top. Yes. So everybody don't pay cash to anybody for the island. You go and pay money to the bank. So, you somebody can get money from you as cash. Yes. It's a, a fraud. You have to write an official report to us. We will investigate it, we will get the money we want, and then the law will take its course. Yes. And also, and also, sir, if someone wants to get task clearance certificate, what is the requirement? For example, now, for those who are, for example, now, I just finished my service and I Ma told that. Madam, Madam, I just told you, I'm not supposed to talk it now, didn't I? Yes. I think you have been on feeling, but I continue with your questions. Okay. So do your uh, right a report on it to the address of the chairman for the service. I promise you we'll investigate it. And whoever is involved, we face police. If you want to go and work the zoo properly, come to the office and we we'll want to identify who the person is so that you'll be properly disciplined. But this story will be published, sir. You want to publish story? I, I can't tell you to publish story. I'm a journalist. Yes, so I just want I just want to get your opinion about it. That is why I'm calling because I can don't just. The, the practice is uh, alien to the new for the internet. Yes. So whoever is involved in it will be, pub will be punished. Because I went to your website and I saw that your website is rich. Like there are some new new innovations and everything. And I was like, this it is not Madam, possible. Can you give Can you give me a break? Okay. Okay. 